Hey everybody, welcome to day 10 of our 12 days of In the Kitchen Christmas. Today is eggnog truffles. So, we're super excited about this one. It should be pretty fun. We're gonna get started. First thing you're going to do is melt your sugar, eggnog, and butter together in a pot and let it boil for two minutes. Sugar. 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 Eggnog. Eggnog. Oh, just about to do that. Don't do that. And butter, unsalted what? butter. These are going to be delicious, I have a feeling. Eggnog is delicious. Okay, go ahead and bring that to a boil on the stove and let it boil for two minutes. We'll be right back. All right, we went ahead and let this boil for two minutes. We're gonna go ahead and pour in our rum and our nutmeg. Nutmeg. Egg. Nutmeg. Nutmeg. Egg. Egg. Nutmeg. Are you good there? No. Okay. All right. Then go ahead and stir that up nicely. Then go ahead and pour it in a mixing bowl. And then you'll add in your marshmallow cream and your three cups of white chocolate morsels. White chocolate. Digging this out of here. Ooh. Oh, this is gonna get really thick. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, this is all right, once you've got that all nice and mixed up and everything's melted and mixed well, go ahead and pour it out on your parchment paper lined pan and stick it in the refrigerator for about two hours. So we'll be right back. We went ahead and let this sit in the fridge for two hours. Then what you'll do is cut small strips through it all. And then again, so it's like a square. Vertical and horizontal lines. Yep, vertical and horizontal lines so that they end up being squares. And then what you'll do is go ahead and roll them into balls, put them on a new parchment paper lined tray, and then put them in the freezer for another hour. And then you'll dip them after that. All right, once you've got them all in little balls, go ahead and stick your trays into the freezer for another hour, and we'll be right back. All right, once you've let these freeze for an hour, you're going to go ahead and dip them into your melted white chocolate. Go ahead and cover it well. We're going to use these little sticks. It makes it a little bit easier for dipping. and then go ahead and place it back on your parchment paper. Mm, and then as soon as you've got those out, go ahead and sprinkle the top with a tiny bit of nutmeg just to make it nice and pretty. And there you have it, mm. super cute. These are going to be super tasty and adorable to stick on any dessert tray this holiday season or to just have in the morning with your coffee. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button for us and subscribe. Make sure to check out tomorrow for day 11. Thanks so much, guys.